Welcome to Tabast Tabast. This is the channel where we have where we have many varieties of gaming videos and many others. I hope you enjoy. Hey guys, EP1K Pucklander here with a new game called Kerbal Space Program. And as you can see, there's this rocket inside the vehicle assembly building thingy. And this was actually a rocket I built based off of John Glenn's rocket, the Atlas, that he used to orbit the Earth three times. And yeah, that's pretty much it. So, you also would have seen our new intro, it's very short, but you would have seen it, and it's cool. So, I'm just going to turn on SAS, and I'm just going to show you how high Gencut here, or Gencot, can get. So, 10! Yeah, so, it's the mammoth here, and yeah. We're going to try to get Gencot here into orbit, and then hopefully get him back to Kerbin. Yeah, he probably won't make it back since I'm the pilot, but it's worth a shot. So, that's the little atmosphere bar, and yeah, so, this is all he sees, it's pretty boring. Some tanks and the nav pool. And we are going to check our orbital path. And yeah. So we're still going up. We still have a fair amount of fuel. SAS is still on. And we're going to get here into the upper atmosphere and try to get into orbit with a little fuel left to see if we can get. So, to see if we can recreate John Glenn's orbit. So, we're just going to orbit three times, come back, hopefully survive, probably not, and yeah. So, I'm just going to pitch this way, or not too much. And yeah, as you can see, Hopefully this does not mess anything. So we are going to cut the engines when we get high enough in the air. So okay, and now let's see. That is not an orbit. That's an, and that's an, wait, Kerbin is an oval? Look, Kerbin is an oval. How did I not notice that? So we are going to, no, 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 bring the fuel down. We are going to only use a little of that. We are going to get into low Earth orbit, and hopefully, Gencot will survive, like we said. But, yeah. I'm just gonna. That should be enough. Cons. You're so close, but I don't want to use any more of our fuel. Just a little bit more. I'm just going to bring it down to like here. Okay, we're not going to be able to recreate John Glenn's orbit, but we will still be able to make... We will land on the North Pole, which is... Yeah, that's a rocket my dad built called the Big Daddy, and it can actually get to like even stuff, it's crazy, it, yeah, so we are just going to warp things, and yeah, we are going up on the Kerbin Oval, and 
Yeah. So once we start going down right here, going to slow the warp. And once the atmosphere bar starts going down, okay, so now is going to be a good time to, I'm just gonna, hold on, and we're just gonna go crazy and fire, and there is the pod. And yeah, he, if the G meter thing was on, and he would just he would be dead because we are going. But <laughs> okay, so if the G meter were on, he would pass out on reentry because we are going straight down, and that's going to pull some serious G edge stuff. So we're just no, not that. That is Sorry about that. Okay, so we are just going to bring the nav ball up so we can see how much G force he will pull. So we are definitely making a North Pole landing. Look, there it is. So we are going to adjust like that. And we're gonna watch the G force go up. Hopefully, our parachute doesn't explode. G uh oh, uh oh, he's dead. He's dead. Yeah. I wonder what happens if I press the EVA button. I'm not going to. Okay. We are coming spiraling down, and I need to edit this. And you can hear the other parts of the atlas exploding. Okay. Okay, parachute. There we go. Gencot survived. Yay. We are just going to warp times four until we hit the ground eventually. And any day now. One. He was only up in space for one hour. But. So we are going to cut the video now and show you when he is about to land. See you after the transition. Hey guys, and I'm back. And that was a long wait. And we are going to blow the heat shield. Okay. <laughs> okay, and yay, Gen Cut landed. We are on the North Pole. So we are going to sprint around. And... Yeah. So that is pretty much it for this video. And this is our, I think, 90 second video. Okay, uh, I, just, I just need to see if I can actually get back into the pod. I'm going to board. And yeah, that is pretty much it for this video. And see you next time. Of course we can't, of course it's not safe to pull the parachute. It's, Okay, bye, bye. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.